Does anyone of you know a person named Narayan Krishnan? An award-winning chef from Hotel Taj, Bangalore, left his job for the poor, old and disabled. He is the one who established Akshar Trust, which feeds the people who cannot take care of themselves. I can proudly say I come from a nation where people cut their jobs to help others. Janani Janma Bhumi Shaswadgadapi Garyasi As Lord Ram said in Ramayana, My mother and my motherland are far, far greater and superior even to heaven. And I believe he rightly said so. My name is Omka. I'm, I'm studying in Silicon City Academy of Second Church Education in 3rd Standard. Today, I'm going to speak about the greatest nation in this planet. My motherland. I bought bush or has been known as India. The land where the taste of water changes every mile and language every tumor. But no matter how far you travel, the warmth and humidity of people never changes. This is the land where my grandfather keep a bottle of water for crows and sparrows in the hot summer. The story of India is nothing but astonishing. It is the story of rag to riches. When India started its journey as an independent nation, we had nothing in our hand. Everything was exploited from us. We were pushed towards property. The India that we know today was built by forefathers with the hard work and currently is the fifth and largest economy in the world. India was always the focal point of the world. We all know Columbus found America. But in fact, he was searching for India. Every rich man wanted to come to India, not only in the earlier civilization, but even now. In this time, every business wants to come to India and be a part of it. There is something special about our nation. The people of India, the climate of India, and the richness of the land of India. And everything one would need in life can be found in this country. I am not the fortunate ones to be born here. The core well of goodness is so deeply rooted in us when the whole world was suffering from COVID pandemic and many developed nations were thinking of their own country, India had other thoughts. India had to provide vaccine to 120 crore people of the nation, yet India decided to provide to many underdeveloped nations. This compassion of talent can be seen from every corner of the nation. Our achievement is that we have a hopeful tomorrow. A failure is done, and today is very really uncertain. That's probably because our youth is restless and wants everything with a snap of a finger. The young like us need channeling, and a wise like you need to be the instrument. <clears throat> this is a country which can digitalize villages and send rockets to Mars from nothing. So I do believe we are on a progressive path. The whole world is looking at India's youth with hope because we are the growth engine of this country and India is the world's growth engine. It's a great honor, but it's also a great responsibility. This is the time when we need to step up a paddle so we can transform this nation towards a new direction. A government is giving us many opportunities so we can rise to this challenge and be a part of this massive change. You'll be surprised to know that India is second in the world in terms of the most number of successful startups. Let me put in this way. If all the people of this country who get this opportunity but decide to quit, I'll stay. Because it's something important. Say your responsibility. I want to be a part of it. I want to be the change of a forefather's ambition for us. Understand at the end of my journey and turn back and smile. Bow my head to this great nation has bow my head to my mother because they are the one and the same. To close, I have these two lines for you. Manzil se pehle na longa khaydam, aage hi aage badam kadam. Jai Hind. I am Omkar Evini in third standard studying at Silicon City Academy of Secondary Education in Bangalore. I thank you.